Are you excited to dig some more bottles? Well, you better get that way. Might be a little messy. Got got a little rain. Let's get to it. Okay, so I pulled a few not too interesting things out of the ground. And got that little jar, and looks like a little flask, the screw top, and another another newer little glass jar there, I guess. But um, got a couple things that look interesting. Let's start with this one. Okay, just a graduated medicine bottle. Doesn't say anything on it other than that. And then this one has a screw top. Still kind of cool. Anchor Hawking. I don't know what would have been in there. But that's different. So we'll pull some out together. Um, this, you see all the sticks and corn cobs and black locust bean pods and all this junk. That was a pack rat nest. Um, if you've never seen a pack rat, it looks like a uh, they're about, like the size of a squirrel, only they're like a gray they're really cute like a gray mouse only big but we're going to pull some out of here um, that little cork top I don't see a seam on it oh there's one right there so it's not as old here we have a cork top another graduated medicine bottle there's an old corkscrew that's pretty cool I'll keep that here's a bottle let's see what that has on it if anything random old bottle Okay, there's a screw top, what does it say? Let's see here. Antiseptic. I wouldn't even know how to pronounce that correctly. Halitosine, something like that. I doubt that's very old. I'll keep that. I've never seen one before. Let's see, was there anything else I had here? What's that one? 
Oh, it's broken. Another one of those jars. Let me put my glove back on and we'll pull some out yet. Well, I got the camera roll. Halitosine. Quality purity. I should hope so. It's different. Cool. I don't know what it was, but it's melted. I'm going to have to go back to the rake. There's a mason jar lid. I hope I was getting that on camera. I wasn't even paying attention. Yeah, let me rake a lot of this junk away and I'll see if we can spot anything. So here we go again. I was pulling stuff back. Found a random little brown screw top. Um, another clear one. Not too, not too special. The remains of a ever-ready flashlight. And a bunch of odds and ends. Um, got a bunch uncovered. This one doesn't look too old. It is just plain, nothing on it. Screw top. Uh, let's do this one. Probably a jar. a bottle nothing on it okay let's do this one another screw top no embossing okay that isn't interesting. Okay. Cork top. Nothing on it. Well, there's graduations on it. That's it. Anything else? Oh, that's interesting. Borden malted milk. Yeah. Making milkshakes. That's cool. Let's see. I think there's one more here. Screw top with the lid on it yet. Anything else? Battery? What's this? Shoe polish? 
like it was black. I haven't found anything that's just wow. Gotta keep that one today. It look, seems like the area I'm digging in right now is all newer, a little bit newer stuff. All right. Five brothers. Huh. Cool little bottle. And another little, I guess these are mixing or measuring cups of some kind, or bottles I should say. And there's another one of those with the screw top. Wyeth and Brothers, Philadelphia. Cool. That's more like it. The sprocket like off a manure spreader. Just another graduated bottle.
here's the hook. Now I found this piece. If you watch my metal detecting videos, um, I was metal detecting a town site from the 1800s, 1870s, and I found just this piece. And I think that went off the end of a single tree. So that's pretty cool. It does have something on there. New Joel. Is that like Poo Joel? Joseph Poo Joel. Look him up. You won't be disappointed. Le Petomain. Okay, I'm going to look around, dig some more wire out get back to you okay I got some cans cleared away looks like we might have some possibilities here get my gloves back on this looks like another style hook off a single tree probably a shoe polish here and it's broken on the corner that looks like what that was Let's see, here we have another W.B. Caldwell. Pretty nice bottle. Nope, it's broken. See that? It's too bad. Let's see. It's an insulator. I don't know if that has wire on it. No. Little insulator. Patent 1883, 1893. Is a I think that says Hemingway, number nine. It's an oldie. We'll keep that. Melted. Oh, let's see. Was there anything else I saw here? A old piece of a stove or something. Should have brought my little hand rake. Something from New York, but it's broken. It's a screw top, got a interesting texture to it. Dig deeper. Don't you hate it when you know you shouldn't do something? 
but then you just go ahead and prove yourself right anyway. Broke my trusty little rake handle. Oh man. I'm going to have to saw that off. The left side of the aisle will probably classify it as a dangerous and illegal weapon. Oh well. Well, here's a few more things I've gotten since I checked in last. Jars, jars, jars. Jars, jars. Shoe polish. Screw tops. Here's another one of these. I think I showed you one before, but it's not that old. Interesting bottle. Bottle says Spencer Udell on it. I have no idea what that held, so I'll have to look that up. Little tiny screw top. Cosmetic jar. It's a tiny little graduated screw top. Another screw top. Says Barton's. Dye Dye and Shine. Martin's Dye and Shine. Looks like a cologne. This is probably another cologne. It says Ooh. Ed Pinod, Paris. That's a big economy size perfume right there. <laughs> I'll have to look one, that one up too. I don't know if that's worth anything. Okay, I'm not seeing anything very exciting at this point. It's another jar. Nice and broken. Here's a screw top little bottle. Okay. Anything else? It's a mouse mouse nest in a can. That's cool. I know there's more. There's an old iron. I know there's more good stuff in here. More of the iron. Let me set you up and I'll let you watch along with me for a little while. Interesting handle off of something. Another shoe polish. Man, these people love to keep their shoe shine. That's good. More people these days should take an interest in how they look, right? Broken jar. Another big one of these. I 
I am going to have to move barbed wire again soon. It's getting pretty difficult to do that. Listerine. Lambert Pharmaceutical Company. That one is right there. Can you see it? I'm not sure. <sighs> Lucky tiger for scalp and skin irritations. <laughs> you lucky tiger. That's funny. Kansas City, Missouri. And it's dripping on me. So there's a nice lid on it too. I've been finding a lot of interesting uh, newer jars. But nothing great that's old. Ooh, look at him. Well, I think I'm going to end this video here. I brought a few back that I didn't have already, and I'll clean them up and show them off. Um, didn't find anything just really amazing, but you probably shouldn't expect amazing when you're digging through a pile of trash that was worthless to somebody. So sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't. I brought home the, this insulator that has patent date of 1893. That's a nice old one. The halitosine antiseptic. It's a screw top. That's kind of cool. Wyathan Brothers, which I believe was a strap side liquor bottle. Ed Pinod Paris. Got little flowers, and I guess that's a basket or something. I don't know. And the Lucky Tiger. That's probably my favorite just because it's funny. Um, Lucky Tiger for scalp and skin irritations. And there's a crack in it I didn't notice. Right there. Oh well, we'll try and save it. Horlicks malted milk. A uh, new Joel bottle. I believe that was mineral. Is it mineral oil? Yeah, pretty sure it's mineral oil. This is a screw top, but it's it's got a it says Cinderella shoe dressing and it's got a little bust of or a silhouette 
on it. There we go. The product in there really hides that. But then we have this. It says Spencer Udell. I have no idea what this is. Looks like a Mork and Mindy Mork bottle, doesn't it? He was in an egg, wasn't he, with a triangle on him? Oh. Well. Anyway, thank you for watching. And next time I go back out there, I will bring you along as well. See ya. Sheriff Murray, innocent women and children blown to bricks. We've got to protect our phony baloney job, gentlemen. We must do something about this immediately. 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 Harumph. 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 I didn't get a harumph out of this.